If you're looking for how to uninstall apps from a Samsung Smart TV, you've come to the right place. We're going to show you how to do that now, and then we'll show you how to uninstall and reinstall an app from your Smart TV. That's something we've had to do a number of times when we sign up for a free trial for a streaming service and then cancel and then sign up again with a different email address. We found that in some instances, it's not enough to just change your login info. You actually have to uninstall the app. If that's the case for you, hang in until the end where we'll show you how to do this. Okay, first, why might you want to delete an app from your smart TV? You could be reaching storage capacity on your TV and want to free up some space by deleting apps you no longer use. Or, as we said, you could need to uninstall and reinstall an app. Regardless of your reason, it's very easy to do. To uninstall apps from a Samsung smart TV, turn on your TV and press the house button on your Samsung remote. The specific options you select on your TV may vary slightly depending on how old your TV is, but the steps are pretty similar across Samsung devices. We're showing you how to do this on a 2020 Samsung Smart TV we bought at Costco for watching TV out on our deck. After pressing that home button, use your left arrow button to get over to the apps button on the bottom of the home screen of your TV. Select it by pressing the button in the center of your left, right, and up down arrows on your remote. This will put you in the apps section and it is where you delete apps from a Samsung Smart TV. Once here, press the up arrow on your remote until you get to the settings gear icon in the top right of your TV home screen. From here, all of your installed applications will appear as large icons in the middle of the screen. Use your arrow keys to move between them until you find the app you want to install. When you find it, press the center select button. Three options will appear beneath it. Delete, add to home, lock, and reinstall. Press delete. A screen will appear asking you to confirm your decision to delete. Press delete again. This will delete the app from your TV, but you'll quickly see that not all apps can be deleted from your TV. Only ones you've downloaded can be deleted. A number of things come preloaded on your TV and they cannot be removed. In that case, you can only remove an app from your home screen. That will just remove it from that bottom menu on the home screen of your TV. If you want to remove apps from a Samsung Smart TV home dock, you can do so by pressing the home button on your remote. Then hold the select button on any app in your home screen bottom menu for a few seconds. A drop down menu will appear with the option to remove. Click remove to remove the app from your home screen. Now let's cover how to uninstall and reinstall apps on your Samsung Smart TV. As we said, we've had to do this when we want to delete our former user data on an app like Fubo TV. From the settings section of the app screen, find the app you want to delete and follow the steps we just covered to delete it. Then go to the search icon in the app screen and begin typing the letters of the app you want to reinstall. When it comes up, click install. To open the app and begin using it, click open. And that's it. It's pretty simple and maybe more robust than you might have realized. And it's a good reminder to see what apps are available in your Samsung Smart Hub before buying a streaming device. Having all the applications you use in the bottom menu bar is a convenient way to access your favorite streaming services. And it may mean you don't need to buy a streaming device. Absolutely. Well, that does it for this video. Let us know what you think of the Samsung Smart Hub in the comments below. Do you use it instead of a streaming device? And if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you can get all our latest news and reviews when they drop. And if you know someone who might benefit from this video, share it with them. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in our next video.